Hey everybody, wish I was bringing a fun video today, but uh, I wouldn't say this one's fun, but it's definitely interesting. I was, uh, I'm making another video, I make maple syrup, uh, I tap some trees every spring, and I was making a video last night, uh, trying to put that together, so that one will be coming out in a few days, or maybe even today later, but I was um, doing my maple syrup thing last night, we had this bad weather come through, Heard a big giant boom and, and looked outside, and this is what I had happen. So, you can, uh, I got some other videos on this. It's a Roush F-150, was. <laughs> uh, I got some videos, you could probably search my name in Roush. Uh, it's a special edition F-150 that they put out and anyways the uh, wind decided to blow this tree down right here right across the hood of this thing last night and the damage is pretty extensive uh, definitely not drivable you can't even get into the uh, driver's side door there's all sorts of parts and pieces cracked all over I don't know if it's I don't know if it's salvageable or not. I'll let the the professionals tell me that, but uh, this thing tree here came down, and it looks like it probably came right down across the hood of this thing. Windshield shot, the mirror over there is gone. Everything on the front here is all boogered up, and. I don't know if the frame's tweaked or something, but you can see there's no gap on this side. And over here on this side, there's <laughs> a huge gap. So I'm not sure if the whole shooting match is tweaked over and it's carried all the way back to, to there. There's a bunch of dings all over everything from this tree exploding. Uh, the tree looks like it chopped parts. Uh, there's my nice new rental vehicle for the next few days. Um, also, some damage. There's about a foot by foot hole in my roof up there. Uh, some other damage to the shingles. There's some damage you can see up up there on the siding also some damage to the siding over here uh, right there and over here from the tree won't see any other uh, the gutters the gutters took some damage damage to those gutters up there and then so that was this tree and then also had another tree come down back here by my shed and it fell onto my shed and there's about a foot by foot hole in the top of the shed up there you can look right down inside of it so that's uh, messed up it messed up the ramp here to the shed One of the beautiful things about living here in the woods, or close to the woods, is there's a lot of trees. Yeah, at first I thought, when I heard the big boom and I heard glass break and everything, I thought maybe my bird feeder fell over. So I looked out and it's still sitting here, obviously. And then I looked out the laundry room door and saw this giant mess. So I've been in contact with my insurance company. I'm gonna try to get get things uh, taken care of here. Uh, like I said, I don't know if that truck's salvageable or not. I know there's quite a few parts there that are specialty uh, Roush parts. I don't know the availability of those, like that grills from Roush and. The, of course, the, the, the matte black decal is a Roush deal. Um, so anyways, that's what I'm dealing with here today. Not a real fun day here. But, you know, 
as they say, stuff happens. <laughs> and uh, I do have a, I've been making maple syrup. And I will make a, a video on that. Uh, that's my little fire pit. The tree did miss that. And now I'm going to have plenty of firewood uh, for next year's maple season. So that's a good thing. Uh, but I'm going to try to put that video out sometime here in the next day or two for how to make maple syrup from scratch. And anyways, I thought I would share this little little setback in life here with everybody. I know everyone follows my channel, loves my train videos. Uh, I try to try to put out a couple of those every week, but uh, you know the the railroad here in Medina um, it's kind of hit or miss. So anyways, hope everyone else is having a better day than me. And thanks for watching everybody. And stay tuned.